as you guys may know by now from reading my Twitter, I came top 16 at a Smash Major. I can tell that story some other time. But what better way to celebrate than with some good, clean fun? Okay, we got a Byleth. We got a Byleth. Uh, this is a character who I can bully. On the other hand, this is definitely a Fire Emblem fan, which scares me. But on the other hand, that line makes me think they're a Lucina player, not a Byleth. So, we'll be fine. We were not fine. Plant. Okay. I beat this character for free, because this character was removed from the game a while ago. Uh, as you may have uh, remembered from uh, a certain Luigi uh, video with a certain Aiden. But uh, yeah, Mario Brothers uh, just kind of beat Plant for free now. Uh, not because of uh, any matchup or statistic things, but just, just because I've, I've beaten a plant so bad that I don't think any plant can ever recover from that shame. Oh no. I don't think I can ever recover from that shame. Yeah. So I think Mario might be a pretty good character. You know what I said about good, clean fun? Enough of that. It's time for the heal. Hey, baby. This is a man of culture. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You got a nair to show that teabag time is over, buddy. 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 Sorry, but you are about to face true despair. Oh no, he understands. He plays Ganon. He understands. He knows it all. Every trick in my book. He knows them because they're his tricks. But I have my one secret Ganon technique. I messed it up. No, I didn't. You're bad. You're stupid. I'm bad, I'm stupid. Homie stalker. You know what you know what we say about that? You know what we say about that, my friend? You know what we say about that? Our cause is just. You know, that experience of knowledge and personal growth taught me what we were missing all this time. The wrong skin. We we were using the wrong skin. Oh come on, buddy. Falcon, come on, come on. No, no. Not about it? Okay, buddy. You were, you were supposed to be a Falcon. I don't understand people who go online with Falcon and don't know. Because, like... Yeah, there's one... Like, playing online players, yeah, there's a lot of little Timmies online. But a lot of people who pick Falcon aren't little Timmies. And a lot of people who go online and aren't little Timmies know the culture. You know? And, like, Little Timmy's doesn't just mean you're young, it means, like, you don't know how Smash, like, w Little Timmy is, like, I don't know how to grab Little Timmy, not, I've never been to a tournament, Little Timmy. It's, like, I think what separates a Little Timmy from a regular Smash player is whether you know who Lanky Kong is. I think if you know who Lanky Kong is, you just get it, you know? And he just got destroyed. You know? Male Corrin scares me, but on the other hand, I've played Fire Emblem Fates. This character doesn't scare me. Low GSP Corrin is either the most terrifying low GSP character, or the scare- Or like, huh, they're probably bad. And I think this is more on the intimidating end of the spectrum. Okay, well, uh, you know, he's not so intimidating anymore. I think he needed to take a minute to reflect about that. And I mean, I respect it. Uh, it. We all needed to take a minute to take that one in. And speaking of what this porn's taking, uh, how about this L? Don't ask me why it was that close. Because I really don't want to explain. Poopsmith? 
<laughs> okay. Okay, we've got Pink Falcon on Magicant. That scares me. Actually, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, Poopsmith gets it. Poopsmith gets it. Like, it doesn't matter what it is. Poopsmith just gets it. Whatever you need to talk to him about, Poopsmith just... He always understands. He's always there. Poopsmith, whatever group... Whatever the group you're in is, Poopsmith is one of you. Poopsmith's always whoever you need him to be. He's always wherever you need him to be. He's always there when you need him. And more importantly, he's always right there taking the hit from my forward aerial. Oh god, that felt dirty. Well, <laughs> that one was just mean. So Mario wins this matchup, but I'm not... I don't play an actual... I don't play Mario the, the way he's supposed to be played. My Mario is far from optimal. But if he's one thing, it may not be optimal. But he sure is. The hero we all needed. Honestly, like, I don't get how people play this game for content without their streams turning into, like, GameCube ASMR. Like, I was on my PS4 controller for Spelunky, and it was still mad loud. And just, like, how do you do it? Do streamers just go to a secret black market to buy suppressors for their GameCube controllers or something? Like, what's the trick? I have to know. You know, this scares me, because even if he is low GSP, this is definitely his main. And if I have high GSP on my main, but they're at low with their main, and we're and we're playing the same character, he's still probably gonna beat me. That or actually, this might not be his main. This might just be raw fundies, Mario, and that scares me. Guys, you're better than this. Don't say it. None of you say it. You're better than this. No one's forcing you, so just don't. I'm not saying it. And I expect you to do the same. But I respect that this guy is going for the same stuff as I am. Maybe the reason why Waluigi's not in Smash is because he supports Koopa Wright's movement. That's my headcanon. Purple is actually the uh, emblematic color of uh, the Koopa Wright's movement. Actually, in Mario's Time Machine, uh, Gandhi, Mario asks Gandhi if he's seen any Koopas around, and Gandhi refuses to sell out the Koopas, and suggests to Mario that he attempts non-violent uh, methods of resolving his conflicts with, Ko with the Koopa race. Okay, but Mario meeting Gandhi means that theoretically, with the amount of recency that that game had, we could have theoretically seen World War II. We could have theoretically seen Hitler didn't kill himself. Mario did it. Mario traveled back in time, killed Hitler, and because there was no evidence, it was deemed a suicide. But we all know the truth. Will. The K rule. I wonder, perhaps. No, it's not him. It's not that Will. It's not that K rule named Will. But, you know, we'll play our game. Oh man. Yeah. That wasn't a funny edge guard. But I mean, like, it's an it's fun it's a funny edge guard in the manner that all edge guards like all spikes and stage spikes are are sick edge guards, but it's not a it's not the cool edge guard. Well, you know, we both went for it. He just went for it gooder. And before you say that's not a word, don't be condescending just because you're more smarter than me am. Okay, gentlemen, pick on. Okay, buddy. Honestly, T-Bag, the T-Bag there, it was supposed to be a sign of a nonverbal agreement. But I feel like it was more like when the Matador gets the bull to charge them. It, I felt like a Matador, and he was the bull, and he I tricked him into dash attacking, man. I And then I waved my cape away.
We may have started on a losing streak, but that's changing. It's time for Forward Aerial Revengeance. <laughs>